Hello, I'm Rachel Carrion, reporting to you live from New Orleans, Louisiana. The winds have definitely calmed down, so I am able to report this breaking news. As you can see, a lot of damage has been done here. A Category 4 tropical hurricane has occurred here, with winds of 140 miles per hour. Levees were built around New Orleans because it's below sea level, but they were designed only to withstand a Category 3 hurricane, so they have failed. The hurricane, known as Katrina, had a storm surge of 20 feet or 6 meters high. Also, New Orleans is about 80% underwater, up to 20 meters in some places. Katrina hit the United States on August 24, 2005, crossing Florida on August 25th. Katrina started to weaken at that time, but then grew stronger when it went into the Gulf of Mexico. By August 27th, Hurricane Katrina was a Category 3 storm. On August 28th, the storm hit the coast by Louisiana. Hurricane, Kat Hurricane Katrina maintained intensity through Mississippi as well. Also, at one point during the storm, the hurricane reached a Category 5 hurricane. The whole thing formed on August 23, 2005 and ended on August 31, 2005, resulting in the official death toll of 1,836 people and 705 people reported missing. Lots of animals were left behind and most were killed. Donations were given and the highest amount was from Kuwait with a pledge of $500 million. Many people have become unemployed due to the storm as well. Though it is hoped that things will get back to normal and get better. Once again, this has been Rachel Carrion reporting to you live from the News for You New York. Thank you.